right, everybody. I'm here to show you what it looks like on Monday's day two of the rubber eggs lab. So I have the eggs here. I did four, but you only had to do two. So you're gonna carefully dump the vinegar out just like that. And then I'm gonna put my water on cold or medium. And I'm gonna do a spray, but like the most gentle spray I have. Doesn't You don't have to do this very long. Mine have been, have been um, soaking long enough that there isn't even white paste on them anymore. They are just ready to go. I don't know if you can see that. They're quite a bit larger than when we put them in on Friday. Um, if you have a food scale or a string, you could remeasure them. All right. Otherwise, we're just going to put them back in their container. Then I'm going to take my second container of eggs. Pretty simple today. These have a little more shell on them yet. I'm not quite sure what happened. But dump them out like so. These have a spot where they were above, um, above the vinegar. So they have a little flaky area on them yet. If yours still have the white paste on, make sure you use your most gentle water setting. I would recommend about room temperature. A little more gentle. All right, and then just gently rinse them. If you want to try to get all the white powder off, you can, but you don't have to. Uh, the lab will work just fine if your egg has some of the white paste on it and the, the calcium in the eggshell is now totally gone. All right, uh, so once again, we're gonna put those back in their bowl. Now, it's pretty simple, but between today and tomorrow, we're gonna leave one set of eggs in water. If you have a measuring cup, it would be nice to leave them in the same amount. All right, I'm just gonna kinda eyeball it and leave it at about half of the bowl. All right? Um, if we were in school, we would measure and all of that, but for our purposes, that's good. And then the second bowl, you'll be able to see the difference in them tomorrow. I'm just gonna take corn syrup here and I'm just gonna glurb them. That's a real scientific term there. I'm just gonna glurb them and cover them and corn syrup. You don't need to cover them. Um, you don't need to fill the entire bowl or container. If they're just sitting in it, that will be just fine. All right, and then between today and tomorrow, we're going to leave them sit for 24 more hours, and we will come back to them once more again tomorrow. Have a great day. Bye.